This 77-year-old patient was referred to me for endodontic treatment of tooth number two, upper right second molar. Tooth had a big cavity in it, as you can see, and according to the dentist, near pulp exposure. <clears throat> tooth was prepped for a crown, so there's a temporary crown on the tooth, and patient was referred to me for endodontic treatment. And that's what we did today, but take a look here. <clears throat> Excuse me, look how much how much, uh, look at uh, the all the pulp stone in the pulp chamber there and look the even uh, the calcification actually extends up the canals look at that starts from here the palatal canal was completely blocked with calcification like a like a pulp stone like that all the way down so i had to use ultrasonics to remove these these little tiny little tiny pulp stones from the canals and uh, making sure that i wasn't being blocked i wasn't blocking myself with these little tiny pulp stones so on tooth number two so the very last tooth on the upper right side so take a look here and here's the post stop four canal systems again upper second molars could also have an mb2 so mb1 mb2 just the buccal and palatal and these were 20 two and a half 23 millimeters working lengths okay and mb1 and mb2 as you can see are completely separate that's another angulation Another angulation and another angulation. As you can see, everything went great. We went ahead and temporized the tooth and referred the patient back to his dentist. The crown is ready, so the dentist will just uh, build the tooth up and put that crown on the tooth, but everything went great. So look for these MB2s.